الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم أما بعد هبت في الله دعوة لله سبحانه وتعالى has many forms and there are many means to calling to Allah سبحانه وتعالى and all of those people who have a part in giving guidance to the creation of Allah سبحانه وتعالى guiding them to the book and the sunnah guiding them to Allah Azza wa Jal, then they have this fadl, then they have this greatness, and they have this bi'idnillah ta'ala, if they're sincere, they have the reward from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And it is better for them than anything in this worldly life. The Prophet alayhi salatu wasalam said, and this was on the battlefield, لِيَنْ يَهْدِيَ اللَّهُ بِكَ رَجْلٍ وَاحِدٍ خَيْرًا لَكَ مِنْ حَمْرَ النَّعْمِ the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi wa sallam said that if Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala guides just one person by your hand, this is better for you than the red camels. <clears throat> better than for you than the red camel. And the red camels, ahabatifillah, were a great prize to the Arabs during the time of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, even up until today, in those cultures that still uh give great status and importance to the camels that you see that the red camel and they have other names for it has is worth uh is is worth an immense amount of wealth that it is it is considered a type of wealth amongst them it is highly valued and so when the Messenger Sallallahu Alaihi Wa Alaihi Wasallam told the Sahaba Radiallahu Ta'ala Anu Majma'een Ali ibn Abi Talib Radiallahu Ta'ala An specifically mentioning this hadith that he was giving them an example of that which they understood that Da'wah ila Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is better than everything, the wealth that you gain in this worldly life. And that those people who strive, whether that be making a website, whether that be making a Facebook group, whether that be making, uh, actually climbing on the minbar and calling the people to Islam, whether that be being in the marketplace and calling the people to Islam, or on the minbar and calling the people to Tawheed wa Sunnah, that all of these are types of da'wah. And no doubt they have, some have greater status than others. But the point is, is that if someone is guided by your hand, or someone remembers Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, that is already a believer, because of something you said or something you posted, then this is khair azim. Someone is guided from dhulamat al nur from darkness to light. This is immense. So I want to encourage myself and my brothers and sisters that are active in trying to remind one another to continue to do so. Because as we know, the reminder benefits the believer. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala Muhammad.